Welcome, my name is Glacia of the Leaf Four. I've traveled afar to the Hoenn region so I make so I may hone my ice skins. But all the trainers I've seen were challenges by weak trainers and their Pokemon. What about you? Would you please me to know him if I go all out against you? She is by far to me one of the most ridiculous Elite Four people. Glazy Glaley. Level 50. Oh my goodness. Alright, we're going to overheat immediately. Uh, well, use the link screen. <laughs> I guess they expected the overheat. Anyway, let's go back to the really ridiculous Elite Four commentary. And since I used overheat, I, my special attack will harshly lowers. But we also have a backup plan in case that doesn't work. We have got Earthquake! And it goes off, and it hits Glalie, and does it shake the Glalie? Yeah! No, it doesn't! It was close though, guys! It was close! And doing so, I am going to have to deal with the fact that it's going to be using a full restore to fully restore Glalie's HP! Oh my goodness, this is not good, folks! Iro was going to use Rock Slide to finish it off! But Rock Slide did do a whole lot of damage. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys! He almost defeated Clayley. <laughs> I'm trying to life in the like commentary like this at the same time. It is really hard, guys. All oh, right. Oh, it used Ice Beam. Not a very, uh, not a super, not effective move, but not a super effective move. Oh no! Iros Rock Slide missed. He probably should have used Earthquake, which probably would have actually hit and defeated Glalie. Is this actually going to end in Iros' defeat? It is! Oh my goodness, guys. What is next? Oh man. Let's see. Alright. Oh, it's going to end up being a Zuko that's going to be going out now. Zuko, guys. Zuko's going to be going in, and just as Zuko runs in, the life screen. Light screen, really? Light screen wears off, and in doing so, we're both. I am buffeted, but that doesn't stop me from using Blaze Kick. And the fact that you use Ice Beam, it's actually not going to be that very effective of a move. But my Blaze Kick's going to be super effective, which totally defeats your Blaley. But you already defeated one of my Pokemon, so you are one up on me, dude. Get it? Alright, Celio is going to be the next Pokemon that's going to get sent out. We're going to send out Azula to counter that move. In doing so, that will hopefully, not entirely surely, defeat her Celio. It is, the hail has stopped, so that's good enough on us. Oh, great, it's using Surf. This is going to be bad, folks. Oh, man, Azula got completely hurt there. That is not good at all, folks. Not good at all. But the fact that I just paralyzed and I completely hurt him, I was able to use Thunderbolt here to completely obliterate the Celio. The very first one, but she has another one. So it could get pretty ugly, folks. So she sends out her other Celio. I probably should have taken out the Mongol race. Anyway, guys, all right, well, cool, it only used hail, so we have an upper hand once again to use Thunderbolt, and completely and utterly hurt her Celio. Will this paralyze? No, it doesn't, but is this really going to matter? Who knows? <laughs> what move is it going to use next? Oh no, it used Blizzard! Darn a hail, that move is 100% hit! So that is something, guys. Oh no! Oh great, it hurt Azula! Oh no, and the phone goes off. Oh gosh, really? <laughs> Hold on. Sorry, guys. <sighs> phone calls, why? Anyway, let's get back to this. Alright, Azula has fainted! Oh great, that's not really good at all! <laughs> eh, Fang's not going to be any help, but let's see if we can't send Ogadai out to do some serious damage. A massive underleveling on these guys here though, but they can be the underdogs. Will I be able to completely annihilate this, or will I be completely annihilated? Oh, I actually go first, and it results in Celio falling, yeah, dudes, alright. Alright, Walrein. Yeah. <laughs> Er, 
powerful Pokemon that's going to be annoying! Oh my goodness. This wall rang. <laughs> uh, anyway. Alright guys, let's go for it! Alright, wall rang actually missed! Anyway, what? <laughs> I guess that's in the later issues that it makes a hundred percent hit. Sorry about that, guys! Alright, it seems that Blizzard is not always 100%. Uh, it is, I believe, like 60 or 50% chance of hitting. And it actually hit that time. Oh my goodness, guys! That almost killed Ogadaya! But, we just figured out it doesn't uh, actually one hit KO it. So, let's go ahead and heal him! <laughs> because that will be absolutely useful! Considering most of the other Pokemon either are super effectively hurt or not super effectively hurt. Eh, oh. Or get normal damage. Ah, gosh, Walrein keeps trying to use Blizzard to take out Ogodaya. But it's not working, guys, it's not working. Oh, great. Now it uses a Citrus Berry. Ah! This is going to be annoying, folks. And it uses Blizzard and hit. Oh no, is it going to really hurt Ogodaya? Or is it going to do very nothing? Oh my gosh, guys! That was seriously hard! Oh gosh! What the heck? It didn't do that much damage earlier! Uh, let's heal again! And she uses Full Restore! Oh, great! Yay! <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright, now I'm gonna use Crunch once again. See? Oh, great! Sheer Cold is one hit KO! Yeah, totally not cool at all. What is with this, dude? What is with this? All right, we're going to do uh, do a Fang here. Fang is going to be cannon fodder kind of sense. Uh, revive Azula. She needs it. Walrang uses sheer coal, but it messes. How about we use a Dragon Breath? Oh, Sheer Cold again, but misses! I think it used all of its blizzards on Elgadaya. A critical hit with that one move. Oh no, not another Sheer Cold! It hit, oh my gosh, one hit KOing Fang. Oh man, guys, this is gonna be intense! It's already intense already, I'm clutching about this! Oh my gosh, guys! Alright, we're going to use. A Super Sonic Aw, oh, great. Not another Surf. Come on! Ah, oh, gosh. Apparently, that is not a thing. Alright. Uh. Alright, we're going to revive Fang once again. See if we can't do anything about that. Alright, Sheer Cold does absolutely nothing. Good, 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 good. And we're going to High Promotion. And it tries to use Body Slam, and it succeeds and paralyzes May, which is totally not cool, guys. All right, it uses Surf because it's like surfing. All right, it defeats May, expected ish. Um, all right, go Fang. <laughs> no ice moves, so you're uh, mostly okay. <laughs> ah, great, paralyzed, wonderful. Fang uses Dragon Breath! <laughs> Alright, critical hit! To oh man, we don't get that paralyzed, but let's try this again! Dragon Breath! Doom, dun, 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 and nothing! <laughs> Absolutely nothing! Oh gosh, please, 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 oh yes, man, that is totally wonderful! I do not get one hit KO'd by Surf! Alright, we're gonna use Dragon Dance to raise attack and speed! Doing so will hopefully allow us to completely completely not have to deal with this anymore. Okay, body slam once again by the fiery giant wall rain. And we're gonna use some dragon breath in so we can get some more hopefully ah oh, gosh, that didn't happen. Uh body slam does a whole lot more than I'd like it to. Alright, we're gonna use a uh, hyper potion because we Fang's like actually one of the few that can actually withstand Buddy Slam from the small ring of nonsense. Oh my gosh, a critical hit. Ah, crap, and also is paralyzed. 
I don't want to keep doing this. This is ridiculous, man. I mean, come on. Sirs. And which doesn't do a whole lot of damage. It does less than Body Slam, but it still does a pretty good amount of damage. We're going to use Dragon Dance once again. Hopefully, we can get some more oomph in our power. And so, it's going to use Body Slam once again in an attempt to defeat my Fang. Fang is going to hopefully defeat it with some Steel Wings. It did not defeat it, but it got pretty darn close. Oh my gosh, that is something I need to heal. <laughs> need to heal, like right now, had 2 HP. I'm not wanting to do that, oh my goodness, but since it are, she already used two, she doesn't have any more full restores to go by, so we're able to defeat Walrang. Totally awesome. And guess what? Fang almost actually levels up. <laughs> nope! <laughs> not having it. I'm not having Fang out with that nonsensical, ridiculous playlist. Yes, she only has three different Pokemon, but five Pokemon in all. Lely, Celio, and Walrein. Walrein is the most ridiculous thing on the planet. Alright, our <coughs> Blaze Kick almost defeats Glalie in one move, but we did not succeed in that. But, in the bright side, ah, oh gosh, come on, I'm trying to say about the bright side, but I keep missing about my attacks, man. Alright, oh gosh, this is getting tight, neat, tight, tight. Alright, we double kick it just to make sure we absolutely hit. And we do, and we defeat Glalie, which in two says, dun 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 dun, our win against Glacia. You and your Pokemon, how hot your spirits burn. The all-consuming heat overwhelms. It's no surprise that my icy skills fail to harm you. I wouldn't exactly say fail to harm. <laughs> that almost beat me. Advance to the next room. There it can it truly confirm the true fearsome side. Pokemon. And she is not kidding. This is Captain Drake of the Dragon Pokemon. This is gonna be the absolute worst. Uh, it is going to be one of the worst. And why? It, it This fight is going to be one of the worst. I will go ahead and say this because he's got nothing but dragons. And like Lance, he can be a big tank. Um, Max Potion, Hyper Potion. Um, these guys. I am going to force myself to use a full restore on Iroh and Okadaya. Um, yeah, I'll use one more on May. That fight just really took it out of me, that last one. Um, I'm going to switch to Ogadaya, and I'm actually going to take the Mako Brace off of Azula. That actually hindered my attacks because of the fact that it was, that they were just able to go a lot faster. Okay. Let's battle Drake. I am the last of the Elite Four, Drake the Dragon Master. In, all, in their natural state, Pokemon are wild living things. They are free. At times, they end us. At times, they help us. For us to battle with Pokemon as partners, do you know what it takes? Do you know what is needed? If you don't, you will never prevail over me. I tried to give him an overbearing, awesome sound. Can you voice act him? What's Yes. Drake, the Dragon Master, has a shell gun! And what are dragons weak against? I was gonna say ice and stormy blizzards, but um, it protected. Oh, could I use blizzard? Boom! <laughs> I, I don't know. Hey, guess what? It almost defeats Shogun! And guess what? Shogun's Rock Tomb actually misses! In doing so, it allows only for Drake to have some time to use a full restore! But that doesn't stop that Okadai to use some crunch! And crunch! And actually, very much so, hurts that guy once again! 
We're gonna use Blizzard once again on his shell gun. We're not gonna keep using this move because we want to save it for some other ugly Pokemon that are completely nasty and deserve the Blizzard. So, his next Pokemon is Altaria. We're going to use it on this beast. <laughs> Dragon Breath. We will get Quad Weakness because Ice is very good against flying dragon signs. <laughs> And completely and utterly blowing Altaria out of the air. At least I thought that. <laughs> Whoa! He didn't even stop! He defeated Okadai in one in a few moves. Alright then, we're gonna have to send out May to quickly go in for the finish. We're gonna have her quickly use her Shadow Ball technique to completely put Altaria out of commission, but it doesn't work. Because apparently, it just doesn't work that way. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> Altaria tries to use Takedown, but it doesn't work. May goes in with a Shadow Ball technique to finish Altaria off. And in doing so, May gets massive points of experience and gains one level. But in doing so, he decides to send out his Flygon, and which could end up being very bad. So in turn, I use Fang, which could or could not be very good or very bad. He uses Sandstorm with his Flygon to create various numerous annoyances, but we are going to use Dragon Breath. Do we get a paralyzed? No, we don't, but he does have the sandstorm a raging and a raging and a raging to buff that fly gun of his. He tries to use Dragon Breath, but he misses! Alright, guys, Fang goes and uses Dragon Breath and does some paralyzing on top of it. Go, Fang, dudes! Go, Fang! Not only that, Fang can actually do some serious, massive points of damage. And I'm gonna do so by flying! Dragon Breath misses once again because I'm in the air! But since the Sand Duel is raging, I will get buffeted, but it really doesn't matter! Fang goes down for the flying hit, and actually, Flygon is paralyzed! Alright guys, if Flygon is paralyzed and he is in serious trouble, if he doesn't do anything, he is in deep trouble! Alright, Flygon doesn't do much because he gets outspeeded by Fang and is defeated. Alright guys, alright Fang gains a level. Flygon once again is his fourth Pokemon he decides to send out. The, sun, the Sandstorm does subside but his Flygon doesn't care and uses Dragon Breath. It is pretty super effective against Fang. It does paralyze Fang but Fang doesn't care. He goes in with his own Dragon Breath. But does he paralyze? No, he doesn't. If he get, but I will go in and use a full restore on Fang since he's been a really great guy. Alright, Fang gets the heal, but Flygun goes in with a crunch. Ooh, that actually hurt pretty bad, guys. That was a critical hit, and it lowered my special defense. That is not good since Dragon Breath. Oh, Dragon Breath actually missed, guys. Dragon Breath actually missed. Alright, I pull off my Dragon Breath, it doesn't paralyze, oh, he uses his own Dragon Breath, and it actually faints Fang, oh man, guys, boy, we're still putting up a mighty fight, I will say that. Alright, we are going to have Zu- no, yeah, Zuko, go out and fight for your friends, go and fight, show them your prowess, use Aerial Ace to defeat your opponents. Will this actually do as much damage as I'm hoping? I certainly hope so. Oh, I didn't do as much as I was actually hoping. Oh man, he actually used full restore? That's actually kind of odd, guys. He didn't use one until now. Alright, we're gonna use a double kick here to do some damage. Although it doesn't do as much as I'd like, it does more than in the other. But the. Aerial X. There we go. <laughs> That's the move I'm thinking. Alright, we're going to double kick again to put him in yellow. And he uses Dragon Breath once again. What is Dragon Breath 2? It puts him at health and it paralyzes. That's not good, guys. We use some double kick to do some damage. But 
It puts him in red. Is he gonna use another full restore? Has he already used a full restore? I think he already has used a full restore. But, yes he has. So that was his last one. Oh no, that's not really good at all. He's rich withdrew for his most powerful Pokemon, Salamence! This is not good guys, this is not good at all. I am gonna quickly go back here and use a revive on Ogadaya. Hopefully this will work out. My oh my gosh, he's using fly, uh, and I think we'll um, kind of sort of hinder that by using Azula. <laughs> <coughs> um, all right, guys. As Salamence uses fly, does some damage, not a whole lot to Azula, and we're going to use a full restore on Ogadaya here to fully heal him, which is going to be much needed in this uh, upcoming thing, because it's going to be either Salamence or Ogadaya who wins this. Oh my goodness, guys, this is going to be intense. Alright, we send out Ogadaya to hopefully pull off that last blizzard to annihilate it. Oh, he uses Dragon Claw. Oh no, is it going to... Is Ogadaya going to run? Is he? Is he? Is he? No, he didn't... Oh man, guys, that was gonna be great until that happened. Alright, let's not shed too much over it. Alright, let us use secret power. Alright, this is not gonna be pretty, guys. This Dragon Claw guy can be quite a nuisance. Alright, we use secret power. We gotta pull it off. Alright, we gotta paralyze, guys! We gotta paralyze here! We gotta paralyze. <coughs> Gosh, this, this announcement's getting kinda hurt my throat. We use Revive on Ogadaya to help him out. Alright, May does get a crunch to the face. A crunch to the face. Gosh, my commentary is getting much weirder as this is going. It is the finale now. Alright, guys. <laughs> I cannot stop laughing about it. Alright, we're going to use a full restore to fully help out Ogadaya here. So we can maybe pull off it. The same move again. Alright. We are going to use Rock Slide just in case. Oh, it actually missed, guys! It actually. Oh, no. What? The what now? <laughs> My move missed? How is Arrow faster? No, that that's not possible. But uh, <laughs> don't know, guys. Don't know. Don't know what happened there. But we're going to try to use a blizzard. Oh, yeah, that worked! And it's going to seriously put a dent into Salamence's HP. Does it fade it? Does it fade it? It does! Yes! You guys think I'm crazy, don't you? Anyway. <laughs> to go gain the level. That is amazing, folks. All right, his Flygon. His last Flygon that has barely any health left. Does this work? Does this hurt? All right, he uses Dragon Breath. Does this faint Ogadaya? Let's, let's certainly hope not. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. He's like, whatever, dude. And Waterfall Flygon. Does this faint Flygon? Yes, it does. We beat the Elite Four, but we're not done here. <sighs> oh my gosh. You deserve every credit for coming as far as a trainer. You seem to know it at first. <laughs> <coughs> I'm gonna die. Yes, the champion is waiting. Oh my gosh, guys. I've never done this before. I have never come at the Elite Four with Pokemon that aren't mid to high 40s on all of them. And, like, even having a couple of 50s in there. I've never had so many Pokemon that are so low in the 40s, and I've gotten this far. I think it's you guys. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I think it's you guys. Um, take the credit. I don't. I'm giving it to you. Okay. Um, we're going to heal Azula with Citrus Berries because that's easier. Because we want to keep as many as possible when it comes to using. Four restores and stuff like that because we're on the live play here. Um, and we'll be fighting the champion. Uh, that will be seven plays. Uh, right. This in this episode is gonna be a little bit longer because it is the finale. So let's hope so. If I don't lose, if I do lose, I'm just gonna cut it until I get back here. Because 
man, I don't think I could pull that coolness off ever again. I mean, come on, I've never done something like that before. Alright, let us come right here. Alrighty. Playing for 27 hours and 28 minutes. <laughs> Certainly doesn't feel like it.